Good day and welcome back to another DBZ Dokken Battle video. In this video we are going to be taking a look at the new Halloween event that has come out. This is the Dragon Family and it's a little homage to Icarus and Goten. Uh, for those who don't know, Icarus is a character from Dragon Ball Z that spent a lot of time with Gohan, Goku, um, just a, a pet basically, I guess in a way. But I mean, it's really cool. It's a cute little card art. Uh, you can get a summonable unit. Uh, basically, you can get a summonable unit, or a free-to-play unit, I should say, that is Goten and Icarus. Like all Halloween events, uh, or Halloween units, this unit will easy a lot later on. But the unit is pretty useful. Or just a lot of fun uh, to have. It's always kind of how Halloween units are, you know, like Grandpa Go Gohan and Pan. It's just like really fun little units. I think with Goten, um, you know, we'll have to see. But it's just one of those collection things. A little bit of stones, a little bit of rewards, but the event is very straightforward. Goten drops from stage one and his medals drop from stage two. You will need to farm, obviously, the different, like, how can I say? You will need to farm 14 copies of Gohan, I mean Goten, because of that, but you do get one from the missions, you only need to get 13. You can use Bond of Friendship to increase the drop rates, to remember the rarity of the unit will increase the drops, and you can also use the Oolong support memory or the Bulla and Vegeta support memory, or now there's even the third one, which is the Bomba and Goku one. So yeah, you got a lot of options now for increasing the drop rates and rewards. Overall, to be honest with you, I think it's a pretty straightforward event. Once you have collected your 13 copies of Goten, you can then go and get the medals that you need to awaken them from stage 2. Stage 2, the medals drop. You need 20 of them. Now because Goten's easy is isn't out yet, you don't need to go and grab yourself like a whole bunch of medals or have a second unit at SA5. You can just max out his hidden potential and max out his super attack level and I think you will be fine. Uh, I really don't see the point in farming a second copy just yet. Obviously that's entirely up to you. But for me I really just don't see it. Like I, I just don't see the point. Of course that's pretty much it. Um, you'll see that I've obviously farmed the copies and then you know of course uh, filled out my Goten's hidden potential system. But again, you can just kind of do whatever you want at this point. It's just not, yeah, it's not that difficult a concept to follow here. I do suggest you get the unit. It's obviously useful for the EZA area. That'll come out later on. Uh, it's useful for its own EZA area later on. And just in general, I mean, it is cool to collect these units. Uh, obviously, as a unit, very interesting. It is on hybrid sands. So we'll have to see a little bit of a support as well. So there's some cool stuff going on there uh, that I think is really cool. And we'll see. But for now, um, that's pretty much it. I do really like the unit, so I am excited to see uh, how well it does. We will take a look at how good Goten is at 100% in the hidden potential system uh, a little bit later on. But yeah, it looks like a very interesting utility unit, healing, defense, damage reduction, lots of really cool stuff. So yeah, but that's it from me. Hope you enjoyed the video. Bye.